Another myth is number two, nonprofits cannot make a profit. Uh, this is maybe a little controversial, but um, as a CPA that's been working with nonprofits for a long time, I'd say nonprofits can, and not only can, they should be making a profit. Um, maybe we don't like to use that word profit, but the reality is we have to have more money coming in than what we spend. And if we spend every dollar that ever comes in, how are we going to be in a place to reinvest back into our organization? How are we ever going to grow our infrastructure? How are we going to expand our programs? So there is an element that I recommend every business owner, and I follow this advice myself, that I need to continue to bring in more money than what I make, not just so that I can live some crazy lavish lifestyle and go jet setting around the world or anything like that. It's so that I can continue to build reserves or I can continue to build a buffer or rainy day fund um, within my business. So for a couple of reasons, I mean, risk you know, management, uh, what happens if something significant happened um, in our life and we needed a little savings fund. Um, but then also, I think for me, having that buffer is a self investment funding opportunity, right? Whenever I come across opportunities where this makes big, this makes complete sense for us to make this investment, whether it's in a person or a software or new, whatever it is, training, um, do I have a little bit of extra money laying around that I can jump on those opportunities when that time comes? And so many nonprofit or frankly businesses, nonprofit or for profit, it really doesn't matter. Most businesses operate with such a slim margin on um, cash reserves, or profit that they don't have that ability to reinvest in themselves, right? And you certainly as a nonprofit, you already know that a lot of funders are going to have a hard time investing in certain things, specifically administration, infrastructure, fundraising opportunities, uh, maybe program expansion that's not evidence-based or some other you know, wish list item that's going to be a hard sell to a funder. How can you as an organization um, develop kind of a reinvestment fund of yourself, right? An operating reserve, uh, but maybe a portion of that is earmarked towards um, self-investment. So you can never get there unless you have surpluses or profits. So nonprofit status, uh, nonprofit, the, the tax status is purely uh, an exemption from paying state and federal income taxes. It is not a business model. A business model, a successful business model requires always bringing in more cash um, than what you are spending on any given day, regardless of whatever your tax status is. Now, Certainly, I don't want to discount the fact that people will argue um, that there is a difference between having surpluses and just outright hoarding the money, okay? Uh, I can see where some people would have an issue if a nonprofit is hoarding funds and they don't have a strategy or they don't have a plan or an intention for how to use those resources in, in a smart way um, and how to continue serving their community. So if you are one of those that are hoarding money, uh, consider having that conversation with your board, um, your finance committee, talk more about what is the long-term strategy of this? And do we want to start crafting some conversation around um, how we want to invest in ourselves, or at least uh, the narrative for what we're going to tell donors when we um, do get asked, you know, why are you sitting on all this money and you're asking me for funds? That conversation I've had multiple times on behalf of our clients. Um, and it's much easier when you have uh, some sort of framework for which you can share with those donors. It makes it a lot easier. So, like I said, nonprofits can and they should make profit um, and plan for that in your budget. Um, so many times I see nonprofits have a zero-based budget, especially if you're in growth mode um, or you've historically had deficits, uh, plan for a profit. You have to plan for a profit.